Good morning, you guys. It is Vlogmas day nine and we're on our way out. So come on, let's get going. So we are off already early today because we're on our way to a Christmas party down at the church. You guys know already how far that is from the house. <laughs> so we have to leave a little bit early. We got some shopping to do and then we're going to go and have a good time. So we're going to take you with us. Lunch time, lunch time. I'm hungry. A good place to go if you're doing Transformation Tuesday is Wendy's. I always get their chili side salad and a baked potato today i'm just having the chili and a side salad but very transformation tuesday friendly quick and cheap <laughs> and yes i have my bib on so you guys will remember if you've been for, with the channel for a while that in our kids church program we do a little incentive thing with them every week where they get little coins for certain things, certain activities, games, memory verses, all that. And then once in a while, they get to spend those coins in a little general store. So today we have got to shop for some of those goodies, toys for that store. So we're gonna come into Sam's and see what they got. Is unbelievable you guys if you're looking for tissue paper get the Sam's six dollars for 400 sheets if you paid six dollars at Dollar Tree I believe they come in 10 sheet packages possibly 20 so max you're only gonna get 120 sheets 400 Always find good toys and Christmas games at Dollar Tree. Look at these super adorable tea light holders. These look like ornaments. An important key to weight loss is plenty of water. So chug a lug. So we're at the church already. Look behind me. I'm gonna take you around and show you all the tables. But tonight is the church Christmas party. And each of the ladies, well, not each lady of the church, but seven ladies had the job of decorating up a table. So let's go walk around and take a look at them before they all get here. Thing looks so beautiful and of course you know the food table is gonna look good because who doesn't love the sight of food <laughs> but anyway we've got some games to put together and waiting on everybody to get here so let me go get busy so here we are putting together one of our little fun things we're gonna do they've got to guess how many kisses are in this container and how many candy canes are in this one so they'll have to fill out their little form with their name and their guess, drop it in the little container and then we shall pick a winner. 
Now here is a fun little idea, guys, that we found online. If any of you are throwing a little Christmas party and need a little game idea, it's called Christmas from A to Z. And what they have to do is write down a Christmas word, some kind of word that pertains to Christmas, and each new word has to start with the letter of the alphabet. Like it could be A for angels, B for Bethlehem, and so on all the way down. Thought this one would be super fun. Then we're also going to play a little feud, a little kind of like a family feud, but not really in the traditional way. We're going to ask some trivia questions. Husband against wife. See who can buzz the buzzer first with the correct answer. <laughs> then we're going to have a name that carol. The hubs is going to play a few seconds of a Christmas carol, see if they can name it. And then let's see what else we got over here on the list. Oh yeah, we're going to do Christmas charades. One person from each table is going to have to get up and act out a Christmas character and their table has to guess what they are. And then let's see. I think that's it. I think that's all the games. So yeah, I was in charge of putting together the game, so hope they have a good time. One year, I had them do a marshmallow fight. It was a snowball fight, because down here in the South, the kind of snow we have are marshmallows. <laughs> and that one was really fun to see a bunch of ladies. That one was just for the ladies, not the whole church. And to see the ladies throwing those marshmallows at each other in a snowball fight, that was fun. We've had them dress one person from their table up as a Christmas tree with garlands and ornaments and things. And then we've also had them dress them up as reindeer. Uh, one year we did a snowman little thing, just all kind of different little ideas. But there's a few for you if you're planning a Christmas party. But now, come on, I got to get these over there and get them ready to go. People are arriving. It's about to start. So come on, let's see what's happening inside. I'll take that one. Well, Christmas party all done. The room is all clean and put back and look. Let me turn the camera around. We've got our little general store set up for these kiddos. Look at all these little goodies, and there's the little price tags in front of them. Because they save up their coins every week, hopefully. Some of them have gotten a few taken away for bad behavior. <laughs> but anyway, everybody at least has some, so they'll get to come shopping tomorrow in the little store. And now, I think we're about ready to go to mom's and call it a night. So come on, let's get out of here. Code word for today is cold. Well, here we are at Mom's, and I tell you what, I am one tired cookie, and my feet hurt. <laughs> it's been a long, busy day, but a fun day, a very fun day, but I'm tired, and I'm ready to call it a night, so I'm going to go ahead and bid you all a farewell. Thank you so much for hanging out with us today, and I want to remind you, it is a divine life, so get out there and live it with purpose, and I'll see you all again tomorrow.